Fusion energy is the energy released when the nuclei or the core of atoms are fused or combined together. With it, we can generate tremendous amount of energy without damaging the environment. This reaction will generate energy for all the suns in our universe. For instance, in our sun, two isotopes of hydrogen, known as deuterium and tritium, are being fused to create helium. An isotope is a heavier form of an atom because it has an extra neutron. Tremendous amount of energy is produced when atomic nuclei fuse. For fusion to take place, there has to be a temperature of 15 million degrees Celsius so that the positively charged nuclei can move quick enough to overcome the Coulomb barrier. The Coulomb barrier is an electromagnetic field that causes light charges to repel and upload this to attract. With the nuclei moving fast enough to build the Coulomb barrier, the strong force, the force that binds photons and neutrons together, takes over and binds the nuclei together creating a new atom and releasing tremendous amount of energy. Scientists are generating fusion energy in a fusion reactor. There are currently two types of fusion reactors that are being tested today. The magnetic confinement reactor and the inertial confinement reactor. The magnetic confinement reactor uses magnetic fields to push the nuclei of atoms in a donor shaped chamber so that they may collide and fuse. An example of this is the International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor or ITER in France. The inertial confinement reactor uses pulses from superpowered lasers to heat the surface of a four pellet, briefly making it possible to fuse. The four pellet is made of hydrogen, surrounded with frozen hydrogen and coated with a plastic coating. An example of this reactor is the National Ignition Facility in the United States of America. The isotopes of hydrogen that are used in fusion reactors are found on Earth. Deuterium is found in water. Tritium is a radioactive form of hydrogen that is found in very small amounts in groundwater. Tritium is also a byproduct of the production of electricity by nuclear power plants, so fusion reactors will help remove this radioactive waste. Fusion energy is the energy of the future. If Jamie Franklin first discovered electricity, he would never have minded there would be so many ways of generating it. From solar panels, to nuclear power plants, to hydro dams, fusion reactors are the next way to generate energy and to power the earth. I invite you to vote yes for nuclear fusion as the energy of the future. Thank you for watching.